There's no host listed. Can't see without my glasses. How do they expect you to attend a hospital benefit when they send you the invitation on the day of? I don't know. But hey, free drinks. Thinking about going. <laughs> I don't know. Smells kind of fishy to me. Oh, everything seems fishy to you, Tad Martin. Anyway, I already have a babysitter, so. Well, oh, that was fast. Actually, um, I was planning on going out anyway. I'm uh, going to go to the movies. See that uh, new movie, Nine, the musical? Oh. And I didn't know if you were going to be here tonight. Yeah, for the kids, that's so. supposed to be fantastic, man. What a cast. Daniel Day-Lewis, Kate Hudson, Fergie. Oof. <laughs> Penelope Cruz. Mm. Choreography is supposed to be great. That's a great idea. Let's go. Um, actually, I um, I have a date. You have a date. Uh, yes. With who do you have a date? I have a date with my friend Rob, the architect. The architect. Gosh, if that's him, he's early. Oh, so anyone get one of these? Yeah, yeah, we all did. You look great. I guess you're going. Well, I don't get too many invitations these days, so... Hey, why why don't you let Tad take you? I mean, really, I, I'm going with a friend of mine. Hey, listen, we could all go together. Yeah. Sounds like a plan. I still got it. <laughs> well, upstairs in the closet somewhere. Well, I'll change go get into it. it. <laughs> Come on. Oh, man. Oh, man. I tell you... I still cannot believe that Annie got away with what she did. Well, you know that was Adam's doing from the beginning. Yeah, that whole double jeopardy deal. He is a crafty SOB, but genius, if you want to be honest about it. Yeah, evil genius. Yeah, Liza called. She got one, too. She said she's going. What do you think? I don't know. I was thinking about going up to the cabin early. Give little Leia a couple extra days in the mountains. I don't know. There's just something about this. The heart reference on the envelope. David? Yeah, maybe. If you're trying to entice me to go, this is not the way to do it. Like, we haven't been to a single Christmas party this year. You really want to go to this thing, don't you? Well, I don't know. It might be fun. And if it isn't, we'll just leave. It's not like it's a long car drive. It's just an elevator ride downstairs. OK. We'll go, and we'll have fun, mm -hmm. as long as my father's not invited. No, I'm not going to anyone's party who doesn't specify who's hosting it. No, 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 sir, we're gonna stay right here, we'll have the house to ourselves, and let's enjoy it. I don't think I see the uh, delirious, happy face at this prospect. I, no, of course I'm, I'm happy, I just... I just thought maybe... This maybe that, that we'd have the opportunity to kind of slide back into the social scene. It does sound tempting. Yes, well, it does indeed. It sounds very tempting. <laughs> you, you are Mrs. Adam Chandler. <laughs> and I want everyone to envy your beauty and know how wrong they were about you. <laughs> um, don't go away. What? <gasps> mm. Oh, Adam... It's beautiful, mm -hmm. but it's so extravagant. Oh, well, I'm going uh, to get sick and tired of this recession, so I want to do something flashy. <gasps> <laughs> Why don't you uh, put that on? I will. Before we go, though, I should go um, get dressed into something more appropriate. No, 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 Has anyone else been in this room and made anybody? No. When you called, I put a hold on the room. How many days have you been here? If you're a cop, I'd, I'd like to see no, some no, ID, no, if I'm you don't cop. mind. I'm somebody who appreciates your help in finding Mr. Devane. And I'm also somebody who can make your life very, very uncomfortable if you lie to me. Do we understand each other? Yes. OK. I ask you a simple question. I want an honest answer. Go. He was here for 10 days. Uh, checked in alone, kept to himself. And as I've told you, the only visitor he had was... A... What? There was someone else. Uh, uh, one evening about a week ago, uh, a woman. Uh, 
I was coming off the elevator and saw her come out of this room. What'd she look like? About five, six, five, seven, blonde, blue eyes. She passed me by and smiled at me. Uh, she was pretty. Uh, I, I noticed a <laughs> tattoo on her neck. Young folks these days, you know, tattoo marking with the a star tattoo. Yes, that, that was her. And she hasn't been back since. No, just that one time. Uh, like I said, Mr. Devane kept pretty much to himself. Uh, no room service, no turn downs. It was all staged. The gunshot, your death. You did all of this to scare me so that I would be afraid of you. You tricked me. Yeah. Okay. What's changed? What's what's different? What, I, I don't understand what is going on here. Why do we leave the hotel? What do you have planned? Was it something that Zach said on the phone? Why won't you answer me? Keep an eye on her, will you? I'm gonna sort some things out. You have to know that he's completely losing his mind. Look. I know you care about him. I can tell you do. We've got to help him before things get worse. Please. Please, for God's sakes, Kat, help me. 